milking us, putting money in certain places where we know in the name of providing health care for the citizenry. Wasifikiria tujui, tunajua na tunaona. Sasa wameendelea, wanasema sasa ukiwa na kuku utalipa ushuru. Watakuja kuhesabu kuku kwako nyumbani. Vifaranga gapi umepata njana? Atitoa 50 shillings kwa kifaranga moja. Ngombe ngapi imesaliwa? Which calf gapi kwako? Sasa that's why I said what we are driving at now is a wash wash economy. And the kiongozi bwana wandai wacha ni kueleze. Taxes, taxing the agricultural products is a preserve of the county governments. Why they were so mekatiba ya Kenya? Vizuri. Sui kama ni mawakili wa mekosa ama ni nini? Agricultural produce cannot be taxed by the national government unless there is value added products when they have been processed. If you process them, they become something else, you have added value. Then you can tax VAT. But raw agricultural products it's only the county government that is supposed to tax through what it is it calls says and the single business license that they also charge for those who are selling those things wherever and what you pay at the market level now the national government attacks everything else it is not raising enough money for its its wash wash programs now it is going down there to look at uh, ni banana ngapi umeleta kwa soko mama mboga mama mboga umeleta mawele kilo ngapi mama mboga ile ngombe yako imbata masiwa ngapi sasa hii mama mboga na wewe ulichukua serikali ukisema mama mboga ndi unaenda kusaidia Misigo yote umeanza kumwekelea umempeleka umefuata sasa unampeleka fuata kwa nyumba yake pale ana, anaweka kuku pale anaweka mawele and, and the truth is you won't raise any money because you have to expand the economy for it to produce money now when you are killing the economy you won't get any money so i don't understand why you think you get money the, nikimalisia mimi najua serikali yetu ilienda ikatuachia IMF na World Bank sasa ndio wanatuongoza hawa ndio sasa wanaongoza policy zao naambiwa fanya hivi usipofanya na unajua hiyo ndio nyinyi mlikataa wewe na kibaki mkasema hapana lazima tuchukue uchukani tuongoze Kenya yetu sisi wenyewe kwa sababu sisi ndio tunajua tunaelekea wapi tuweze kuenda mbele now our country is captured it's captured by those who are there real capture state capture wachana hiyo mnaambiwa real state capture is now every sector of the economy imeshikiliwa na hawa wash wash people namna hii they have invited the foreigners to come also work with them in murking us that is why no sector is performing. Hakuna niambie sector moja. Moja nielese moja. Moja ile inafanya kazi. Ni gani? Sekta ya kilimo inafanya kazi. Kaawa ndio hiyo tuliambiwa oh katero inafukuswa siyui nini nini nini. Hata wale walikuwa wananunua wakafukuswa. Sasa tuko chini huko. Majani chai inaenda hivi. Hata pesa wakipata ya kigeni wanakata dola sa wakulima wanaweka. Hiyo tunajua. Hiyo sekta iko hivi. Manufacturing naona wakifunga. Soon we are going to be in ICU. That's why we are saying we can't wait. That's why we are saying baba utatuongoza tuweze kuokoa. Kuokoa Kenya. Si ile yao ile. Ni sio hiyo yao hiyo. Tuweze kurundisha uchumi wetu pale ilikuwa ina iko tuweze kuenda mbele. Otherwise tukiendelea hivi 
Sijui tutakuwa namna gani miaka ingine tatu. Wangapi wanasema tushikane hivyo tuendelee namna hii? Wangapi wanasema asimio iendelee kuwa kusimama imara? Wangapi wanasema pia ni endelee kuwa kwa asimio tukienda mbele? Na tusiwe na wasiwasi na kuwa na agenda ya parokio. Sisi tunatoka huku, sijui hawa natoka wapi. Kitoka huko na mwingine anatoka kule ndio unapata nini? What matters is this opportunity, economic opportunity. Hata ukitoka mahali ukue na mtu wako hapo ambaye anakumaliza na ni unasema ni wako. Kama vile senator wetu alisema, friendly fire kills. So if your brother messes up the economy and you can't take your children to school, what is the story about him being your brother? This is nonsense, isn't it? Nimrudugu yako hauna shinda na yeye afanye mambo yake kwa nyumba yake kwake nyumbani. You don't have an issue with that. Lakini mambo ya uchumi na kuendesha inchi ipatiwe wale wanafanya nini? Wale wanaweza. Tunaelewana? Kwa hivyo bila kuendelea saidi nataka kusema kutoka hapa wiki ingine mbili next week towards the end of the next week tutakuwa Meru tunataka kuanza kufungua ofisi Meru ya branch ya Meru na recruitment chief it is already kicked up imeanza leo alafu after that tutakuwa Muranga tuko na program I'm announcing the first two stop of us Tunaanza Meru the other weekend not this one I love after that takuwa Muranga after that to announce the other destinations but that's where we are starting we want to move hii shinda ya Kenya itangoja sisi tukikaa tukiongea tukipiga ngumso tu lazima tuhusike na tuonekane na tugunuse na wananchi wameanza kuelewa tuwaeleze saidi tuweze kuenda mbele kwa hivyo nataka sasa kwa heshima kubwa tusimame sisi sote tuweke ile wimbo siwi ni gani ya kumkaribisha baba hapa aweze kutuzungumzia eh eyo hey, weka hiyo ni asimio si ndio siweke kwanza basi ama ingine kama huku na hiyo sio lazima ah, basi